I look like I have a five o'clock shadow. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kyra Sean. Welcome back to another edition of Beauty Monday. So for today's video, I'm going to be testing out some new powders um, that I got today. They're not really new powders per se. They're just a new color in a powder they already had. Um, I wanted to go down in tone, I guess you could say, for the Maybelline Fit Me powder. Um, I have the really light one and then I have the darkest one, which kind of work with me as a translucent and like a... Um, like an all over face powder in the summertime. So I needed to change up those colors because obviously I'm a little bit lighter now that it's winter. So um, let's just say I ran into some trouble. So if you guys wanna see how I got myself out of that trouble, make sure you stay tuned. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell right now because you wait till later, you may forget. You don't wanna forget. So let's go ahead and do it right now. If you're worried about this unit that I have on my head, yes, it's a wig. I read it on my channel last Friday for the Fab Friday. So if you wanna check her out, make sure you just click the link up above. Um, yeah, and this, um, the products that I use in my face are all drugstore friendly, drugstore prices. Um, I you did use one product in this video because I had to fix what I messed up. So don't ding me on that, but you guys will see what I'm talking about. So now let's go ahead and get into these powders. <laughs> so this is the Maybelline Fit Me Medium Deep Finishing Powder. So I'm going to use it as a setting powder under my eye. Um, I feel like this color is more like a... I'm assuming like this is supposed to match like, you know, the color of the powder. So it's giving me really like tannish yellow vibes. I don't know if you guys can see that, but like it's not, it's not yellow. It's like more like a tan. So we'll see how this does. So let us wet our sponge really quick. I'm scared about this y'all. This looks tan. Ooh, let me just take some off a little bit. Mm. I feel like my sponge is too damp or something. I don't know. It's really bright, y'all. Oof. I don't know about that. But we are going to see. We are going to see. It's really just sitting on top of my skin. What's happening? What the heck is going on? I don't know what's going on. All right, now let's go in with the uh, dark. I have used this one before. I'm gonna put that on the rest of my face. Ooh, because obviously I can't use the one that I wanna use, which is my Laura Mercier Translucent. Ooh, that's too dark, that's red. Oh no. Oh, oh no. Oh no, 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 ma'am. That is definitely red. I am putting that down. Oh my God. <laughs> what did this do to my skin? It turned me red. Yeah, I need to get this off. This is horrendous. Get away from me with this. Oh my goodness. Now, I will say it's not drying, like it's not like feels tight or anything, but it literally just sat on top of my skin. I don't know if my sponge was too damp or I don't, oh my goodness, I don't know what the heck just happened. But this just ruined, <laughs> this just ruined my day. Oh my gosh. Now, I feel like if I do, if I do the, my normal powder, it's going to make it worse. But you know what? Let's find out. Let's see if we can neutralize this a little bit. Bathing, baby girl. Come on, Laura Mercier, help me out. <laughs> I look like I have a five o'clock shadow. What the f <laughs> What the fudge? Even this weird like line right here, it's like not 
budging. It's like not budging, y'all. It's not moving. What is happening? I should have known this was going to be too dark. As soon as I looked at it, <laughs> but as soon as I looked at it, I should have known. Like, I should have known. Like, Kai, what was you thinking? I need to try to neutralize this because she's going to be flashback Mary. Flashback Mary. Okay. Oh, Lord. So I'm going to put some contour on this. I need to try to fix this situation because she look a mess. <laughs> All right. So I'm just going in with the uh, Fit Me the lighter color to kind of lighten up this area down here and then I'm going to brush it off just to give me some type of definition or something I mean goodness gracious just left me with nothing all right let's spray her down and see what happens and I mean down Come on, Morphe, do your magic. Give me something here. Oof, Jesus. This area is not as light as I would like it to be. I don't even know you're supposed to do that, but whatever. I just did it. And I'm just fixing this with my Laura Mercier until I get me the correct color of my powders. Wichita Falls, Texas. I need you to do better so I can stop getting trash. <laughs> I should have known better. All right, so that's the best we're going to get with that situation. I'm just going to leave it alone because I keep picking with it. It's going to get worse and worse. So... Let me just take this L and just fix what I can fix. All right, so let me just go ahead and leave this alone because I keep messing with it. It's going to get worse and worse. So let me just do my finish up my regular routine, and then I'll be back to show you guys what we end up with. All right, guys, so this is the finished look after I added all my highlight and extra blush or whatever else you want to call it. Um, I think it came together in the end very, very well. However, I will never do that again. It stressed me out way too much, and I'm just, I'm not about that life. I need easy, simplistic, you know, just put on and go. But now you guys can see that it can be fixed if you have the right products. So um, thank you, Laura Mercier, for coming to the rescue and muting me out a little bit um, because I definitely need it. But as you can see, it's still a little dark and, like, reddish in this area. Um, yeah. But um, we still made it work somehow, and it came together with this look. So um, thank you guys so much for checking this video out. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share. Make sure you also hit the notification bell so you don't miss any other videos coming on the channel. Um, I appreciate all the love that I'm getting on this channel so far. We're almost to a year. We are almost to 500. So make sure you keep on subscribing. Make sure you keep on sharing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And um, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Oh, I also want to give a special shout out to my friend, Mary Novak. Um, she subscribed to my channel a while ago, but she's just now making herself known by literally watching every single video that I have on this channel and commenting on the video. She's literally binge watching my channel, you guys. So um, shout out to her because she could be doing something else with her time, but she instead decided to show me love. So um, yes, my Air Force family is still around and they are still super supportive of me. So um, shout out to Mary. Also shout out to Joey um, back in Vegas. Again, another one of my uh, Air Force family members. Um, she also shows so much love on my Facebook. Um, she's always sharing my videos. So shout out to Joey, shout out to Mary, and shout out to everyone who just continues to show me love and support. I appreciate you guys so, so much. But let me not make this super sappy, you guys, um, or super long. I love you guys so much, every single one of you guys, and I will see you guys. <laughs> I will see you guys next time. Love ya. Bye.